good morning. Our office is in my bed, our bedroom, so I'm whispering because Glenn is still sleeping. I'm logging in remotely. Do some stuff for work. Doing some database builds and some other stuff. I lead an exciting life, as you can tell. All right, well, Glenn and I are just about dressed here, and um, we're going to go get some breakfast and then uh, go to the funeral. Um, we're going to be spending some time with Eddie and Sherry after the funeral, along with some other friends and family. So that'll be most of the morning and early afternoon. And then after that, I'm not really sure what's going to happen, but that's what's going on so far today. Waffle House, waffle, waffle house, waffle, delicious, eggs, bacon, pork chops, food, mm, breakfast. Looking for cough drops and Kleenex. Cough drops and Kleenexes. Cough drops. Kleenexes. Uh, with lotion. Well, we are done with the funeral and the visitation and everything else. I have to say, this it was an amazing, amazing time. You don't think of funerals being amazing, but it actually was, the church was packed. It was standing room. And I was so proud of um, of Eddie and Sherry and and, and Nick and Jeremy and, and everyone that spoke. To me, it's just a testament to how strong their faith is that they could do that and, and, and still be somewhat composed. And uh, it was a celebration of life. And at the end, I think that's what a funeral should be. Is a celebration of someone's life and the things that they've been able to accomplish and the people that they've touched. And uh, as evidenced by today's turnout, he definitely touched a lot of people. I hope Eddie and Sherry and Nick and Matt can, um, and the rest of the family can cling to that in the days and months and weeks to come. So Jay was trying to play the Lego Lord of the Rings game on the Kindle. And I, for the life of me, cannot figure out how to play it. You know the shows, you used to know how to play it. Well, yes, I know the shows, but it doesn't mean I know how to play the game. But he liked the he liked the intro and stuff, so now I'm introducing him to the Lord of the Rings. I know he's five, but he's seen Jaws and Jurassic Park, so I think he can handle Lord of the Rings. I was all prepared to show you dinner, and I she is very, um, totally spaced out. We've been talking about Mad and and Eddie and Sherry and just everything else, and just my mind went away. But uh, there's the fried chicken. We had mashed potatoes and green beans, and it was delicious. It was super delicious. I know the last few days of vlogs have been a lot of talking, not a lot of activity, and it's all been about Matt and the funeral and. I, you know, I, in some ways I do apologize for that because um, I know it doesn't make for very exciting vlogs. But you know what? In real life, not every day is extraordinary. Not every day is epic. Not every day is awesome as far as doing things and, and whatever. To me, part of what makes life extraordinary is the, is the little moments in life that you do. Spending time with your grandson. And, and having fun. And having fun. And having fun, but there's different ways to do this kind of things. And so for me, that's what I do, do and find comfort in. This is just life. And when you vlog, especially how I vlog, this is what part of life is. It's, it's being there for friends and sharing the things that are important to you. And right now, what's important to me is sharing my love for my friends and for the people that I care about. And Eddie and Sherry, some of the best people I know. You don't know them per se, but I do. 
and it was important that I was there for them and experience and let you be able to experience it in, in some fashion. Anyway, thank you so much for listening. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, thumbs up, subscribe. I'll see everyone tomorrow. Bye.